How's it going guys? Today we've got a 2006 Mitsubishi Colt Rally Art 1.5 litre turbo. These are a weapon of a hatchback. 111,000 Ks on the clock on this one. Sitting all round on four corners with Yokohama tyres. Plenty of tread left on these. These are like a baby Evo. They're a heck of a lot of fun and they handle amazingly. So if we look inside this vehicle, relatively decent seat room in the rear. Got enough room for an adult to sit in the back there whilst plenty of room in the front. This one currently doesn't have a head unit in it. We'll be fitting an Apple CarPlay system to this one. Now these have a nice, very, very snappy little Myvec turbo engine in them. 1.5 litre. The vented hood, rally R badging, red top motor in here, plenty, plenty of power, incredible little things actually, like a little rally car, and they look quite outstanding, certainly a little bit of a head turner. Let's jump in and go for a quick drive and see how they go. Right guys, here we are in this 1.5 litre Colt Rally Art. They're like a baby Evo as I mentioned. And they certainly feel like they're from the same pedigree, the same stable, so to speak. Plenty of pickup, especially first, second and third. They pull a lot harder than what you'd expect for a 1.5 litre. Lovely transmission in these. The clutch in this particular model feels like it's been replaced fairly recently as it's got plenty of bite to it and the pedal feels great. Handling response is excellent. The turn in in these is incredibly sharp. Don't feel like an understeery sort of a vehicle, quite balanced. Certainly a very light car. Hear the whistle of the turbo. Got a bit of induction noise. It's very smooth, the engine purrs long. Got great brakes on these as well. If you really want to stop them up quick, you can. Partly due to the fact that the vehicle weighs very little. It's a very bare bones sort of a car where there's no unnecessary fat added to the mix. Really hard to stretch their legs around public areas like this, but they're certainly a lot of fun on a track or on the back roads. They love windy roads. They just handle incredibly well and they sound really nice, that very, very uh, responsive little motor that revs up to about 6,500 RPM redline. Pedals are really nicely positioned so you can heel and toe downshift in these things. Turning circles very tight, obviously being a small hatch. And they're just a really lovely little vehicle to be in.